Oh my god. I'm in love with this character. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm in love. <sighs> Alright, let's go back a little bit. So let's pause this up. Alright, what's going on guys? It's your boy Floki. We are back at it. Another video. And today's the big one. We are reacting to the boy Anji today. Oh man, I'm so excited. Uh, I just got no words to describe how I'm excited for this character. Um, and we'll talk about all the, everything between his moveset and everything. So let's get into this trailer. Oh my god, that music is just so good. I just can't get enough of this. I had to re-record this. Because the audio is messed up, but you know, yo, yo talk to him, Laundry. Oh, the music? Oos. Ooh. Ooh. Uh. Oh my god. God. This gets better every time. Okay, the throw. Oh, the orb. Well, we're back. That's so sick. Stops what he's doing. Yo, uh. Oh my god. I'm in love with this character. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm in love. <sighs> Alright, let's go back a little bit. So let's pause this up. So a couple things that we get to notice here. Um, So this... It's kind of like a normal air dash route um, into a Fujin, um, which we'll go into the breakdown later. Um, that's a jumping dust, I believe. Uh, that's a nice answer. I think I want to say that's heavy slash, but this, this like, is a normal Fujin route you can go into. Oh man. And then this is this, this, this is the juice. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that sight. May about to take a mix up, but she gets hit anyway. It's nice to have an Oki character. And then you get into a full thing into the super. This super looks gorgeous. This is probably the coolest super to me in the game. Oh man. I, 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 I just can't get enough of just the way he moves in the game. I think he, from what I heard, uh, he's not finished yet. But just look at this like, look at these normals. Look at that. Look at this. So using drift to get a full combo. The jump dust pits him away. So I wonder if that wall bounces. Um, so the Fujin, so the, anything with Fujin does not wall bounce. So it's something to kind of note. So simple, like, you know how Leo, Leo does like S, H, S and bounces? It doesn't with, um, Anji. So it's nice to know as well. Um, and then, yeah, the throw. This is just icing on the cake. Oh, man, I'm sold. Uh, I'm, I'm in love. I'm in absolute love with this character. <sighs> and that music? Oh. That's just too good. I'm in, I'm in, I, I can't get enough of this character. So again, all rights go to Arxis and the guys in the next game, Game Plus Expo. I'm going to put a link to that, as well as the link to the trailer that we watched in the description. Um, so let's watch this a little bit and let's get some more info. I did not... Hold up. Professional... Character? Uh, if you are an old-time Guilty Gear fan, this character is nothing new to you, but if you Oh, look at my man's posing! Exert, uh, this character is a look at my man's posing! Oh my god, what can he, what can he so move in? young blood like me, uh, it's sort of a learning process on what this character does. I do uh, like how he- I do like how he looks. He's all-rounder character, meaning that he's sort of like a jack-of-all-trades, he has access to a lot of good tools, um, but it's actually a little bit tricky to play despite the all-rounder. Okay, uh, that's fair. What you would That's think fair. from an all rounder character, right? Uh, so he's got some very strong normals, uh, good defensive options, and mix up tools. Okay. Uh, he is a little bit slow. Um, so he will take some practice. Ooh, to looks like he has a dash uh, he attack. Has very good long range normals, oh. multi hitting normals, and a Let's lot of his slash. special moves give him guard That's... points, which allows him to blow through the opponent's attack. A guard point sounds so, like someone familiar, right? Two special moves that Anji has are very core to his gameplay. The first being Shitsu 
which is core circle forward and punch. Oh, or, yeah. As it's more commonly known, the butterfly. So Anji will send out this slow moving projectile that. Okay, so right off the bat, very slow character, but has really good normals to kind of back them up, as well as, you know, just. The look at my man's looks in the game, man. Hit, Do you see how he moves? And turns into a hush. So because this move startup is so slow, uh, you really want to use it when you have advantage over the opponent. So if you again, my piccolo players know exactly what that means, right? Like, come on. Do something like land a throw. You can put a butterfly on the opponent. Stop. And pressure, you can do a super to it. <laughs> this is this is great. And that gives Anji the opportunity to run up and go for a mix up. I love it. So he has The throw looks good too, but yeah, no, this is kinda like where most like I watched a lot of plus R and a lot of it is just that, you know. Just a lot of running up, doing doing some moving. Easy to understand set play options. Where you can Ooh, run I like forward that. and do overheads or lows or throws. Okay. Um and your opponent has to respect. That's clean. Uh, the other special move also, where's the HUD? His gameplay is Fujin, which is a four. Are they done by doing core circle forward and heavy slash? So this special are they move is super changing fast the HUD too? Range, uh, but it is actually unsafe on block, meaning okay. that Anji's gonna have to cancel into one of its four follow-ups to keep. Okay, so he sells the four follow-ups. Okay. The four follow-ups in order go from punch to heavy slash. So we're going to start from weakest and go to the strongest in terms of button strength. Uh, Shin Ichisiki uh, is... These names are godlike. Which sends Anji up into the air. Ooh. Going down to the so this is a good tool to keep yourself safe while still keeping pressure on the opponent. You can probably so RC off that too. You can probably you PRC. Land, you right? PRC drift pressure. down. Uh, it's basically if you catch Maybe. your opponent sleeping or trying to hit a button, you can counter hit them with the P follow up and then go in for more offense. After I respect that into the orb okay. Once your opponent I mean, I mean butterfly shit. The Fujin, <laughs> you can start mixing up with the K follow up, Isoko Tobi. What's the K follow up? Which is an empty pop. So while this doesn't actually Ooh. do any damage, it leaves, con uh, it leaves Anji at a state where he can go for a throw and some more pressure. Beautiful. He can just land and do more pressure with, with his normals. Uh, because it has so much startup on it, though, the opponent can mash and hit you. 100%. So you really want to go for it sparingly once they start respecting your other options. And you can sneak this in when they're not paying attention. I love it. If you want to keep things very safe, the S follow-up, Nakiha, is a quick low that combos after Fuji. Ah, so that was, so the, that was your, the little slap that he was doing. Okay. Combo ender with Anji. If you can combo into Fujin into the S follow-up, it causes a soft knockdown. You can run up and do more pressure. Or... Okay, so what are we feeling like so far? So number one, and kind of the big thing, is that this character is very heavy on his different follow-ups he can do, um, you know, with Fujin, and then you can do, like, different things with, like, the P follow-up, I think PRC drift down, or PRC left right, um, and, I ho and with that, you know, you have that. I mean, obviously, the, the main thing will be butterfly into whatever you want, kind of thing um uh, the kick thing i think is smart um uh, once you get those other options like you mentioned kind of going um uh, but man his buttons too like this character just looks so good blocking, it's a great tool to just end the block string safely and return back to neutral since it's very difficult to punish both moves sort of push you away from the opponent so they're going to have difficulty uh, so you can't you for just ending it so out. you can't really off so not nice overhead on the knockdown sort of a partner so can't really follow, orb the it's the h follow -up which is a slow overhead. That's, so that's combo so, tool. like his kick follow-up, uh, it has some startup to it, and you can be mashed out of it after using it. So it's another tool you want to use once the opponent is respecting you. Uh, <sighs> and it leads to a combo on hit and a massive combo on counter hit. So Ooh. this move is unsafe on block. You want to use Obviously. it a little bit sparingly. But if you do catch the opponent sleeping with it, you can follow up with another combo, especially in the corner or the counter hits with more offense afterwards. So a lot of Anji's pressure in, uh, is sort of similar to previous games where you have you can stagger into your different follow-ups and keep the opponent guessing as to what you're going to be doing. And then you want to mix up your low and your overhead. I see. Hmm. And it's um, very easy to understand the pressure. What like, was that? Very strong options. I wonder what that is. 
his final two special moves, which you also saw in the trailer, are Ko, which is sort of an anti-air leap. So you'll notice it doesn't hit the opponent on the ground, so it's a move that you want to do as a combo ender. So it causes hmm. a hard knockdown uh, on hit. Hmm. Interesting. I don't. I think I've never seen so a character do have that. I've never seen a character have that before, where it's like, so I've never seen a character have, and I don't think any fighting game I've played, have an air hitbox. Like, it doesn't hit, like, have a grounded hitbox, so, like, different from Leo's DP. Um, I don't know if it has DD properties, I hope he goes into it. Um, but that's, and I've had the hard knockdowns. So you'll see this used as I'm, a. I wonder if you can paw off of it. Air combo ender from the ground to cause a hard knockdown and continue your offense. Interesting. Uh, the final move he has is Suigetsu no Hakuobi, which is done with... Hello? So while this is actually not an attack, it's sort of a dodge. The whole a dodge? The is uh, moving forward, he will guard point the enemy's attack. You say what? Forward. And afterwards, you're free to go for a throw, go for some normals. Let me actually set Eno to attack so you can see... Okay, so guard point. So this is like Piccolo before so Piccolo had. This, be move? this is Piccolo before. This is Piccolo before Piccolo was Piccolo with guard point. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my lord. I love it. Let's you guard point through the opponent's attacks. So if you think the opponent's nice. going to reversal or just mash I'm up your pressure, or I'm, even I'm just so neutral, sold. I'm so sold on this character. Like you can't, like you, can you, can, you can't look at this character and be like, this is Floki. Floki can't play this character. No, no, Floki, nah, nah. What? No. So it's not exactly the same as like the Temkin's guard point on Hammerfall. Sick. Uh, that actually is a property that's attached to uh, his. Other guard point move and block attacks while, during the start of the move. That's tight. So he can still get hit out of it. The so trick timing can be a little tricky. Interesting. But that is a property that's on Fujin as well as his anti air ender. Both can be held to increase the startup but add guard point to the beginning. Interesting. So you can really alter the timing of his attacks and blow So you can. You can. So you can add the guard point to. Wow. Wow, I, I, it's done. Interesting. I'm sorry I'm pausing the video a lot, but for his super, he has Isei Ogi Sai. It's a multi-hitting projectile super that is used to right. combo. Sonic so Hurricane. Uh, and that might not uh, Anji has one more super that unfortunately is not ready yet, so I won't be able. Come to on, play. man. Uh, we'll be showing off more gameplay of. Eno you know, and Anji in the next few weeks, so just stay tuned for more okay. of the last two characters on the roster. Uh, I'm really excited for you guys to see what these characters can do in practice um, with someone who has more experience with them than with Akira-san and the showcase. Alright, so overall <laughs> so overall I think the character looks fucking bananas. Um, the options of using um, Fujin in a lot of different routes, um, the guard point into Fujin or guard point into the DP um, helps in different things. Um, his combo routes seem interesting, his dagger pressure seems really interesting, and like he mentioned before, it's, he's not like a very like easy character, like, he is going to take a little bit, he is a little tricky, um, especially with the different follow-ups and things like that, and especially with the new system in place, you know, that's kind of... An important route to take with it as well. You know, like he has all, like, he looks like they did a really good job of implementing him from Plus R to this game. And potentially, too, and really quick, want to talk about this um, the delay of Guilty Gear Strive. I know that's a big topic that everyone's talking about right now. And my thoughts on it, I think it's a good move on Arxis's work, uh, Arxis's plan, rather. Um, you know, being able to firmly like finish up the game and polish it, especially the online system was garbage in terms of the lobbies, but the netcode is ridiculously well, well made. Um, you know, and the fact that they're planning on a second beta potentially. Um, so hopefully, um, if they do that, maybe some Anji gameplay. You know, that'd be that'd be phenomenal. I totally did this. I'm so sorry. Um, but no, yeah, I am super super stoked to have Anji in the game. 
Um, and <laughs> now, yeah, um, and then in terms of this channel, um, things of that, we'll get into another video with that. Um, but no, yeah, um, I'm so excited for Strive still, even with the delay. Um, the game still has my heart right now. Um, Anji being kind of the main squeeze right now. Um, yeah, again, looks like really good normals, looks like really good specials on top of that and everything in between. So, excited to have him in the game. Let me know, guys, how y'all feeling about Anji? Do you like him? Do you hate him? Are you going to hate getting Butterfly Okied 24-7? Are you excited to give out the Butterfly Oki? His super, by the way, looks ridiculous, and I know they're, they're, they're finishing up uh, the rest of the character, and, and you know, which we'll get into in another video with. Um, but no, I'm just, I want to put this out there. I'm super stoked for Anji. Um, but let me know in the comments down below what do you guys think about Anji. Are you excited to play him? Uh, and things like that. Are you excited for a potential new beta? Um, and what are your all thoughts about the stra about Strive being delayed a little bit more? Uh, sound off down below and I will catch you guys next video. Peace out.